I've always been a big fan of Louis Theroux, and of course I'm fascinated by Scientology. Who isn't? Any organisation that tries to keep itself secret, well, you just want to know more, don't you? You hope, then, that Louis Theroux and director John Dower are going to eke out more information because they have different techniques. So, for example, well, for starters, they do what other people do. So they drive down to the Sea Org Centre and basically wait outside Scientology's headquarters, waiting for people to come out and have a bit of an argument with them, which they do, but that's all a little bit predictable. And also they reenact scenes. They hire actors to play the head of the church, David Miscavige, and even Tom Cruise. And those scenes, when they are reenacted, are compelling, but they don't really give you much insight into stuff. You don't learn any more than you did before. Their ace in the hole is Mark Raspin, who is a head enforcer for the church. But it's like Louis doesn't know whether to be sweet to him to get information or to push him into a corner and confront him on his violent past. So at the end of the day, while it was entertaining, I felt like other documentaries like The Panorama, like Alex Gibney's Going Clear, gave me more depth than this does.